it. Wait, can I maybe try something on you? What? Like a knock knock joke? Here. Sup, dudes. <clears throat> hey, girl. Cool if I walk this way. Just rolled in from Texas. Name's Peyton K, but my friends call me PK. First of all, are you a crazy person? Secondly, K? Like, TK? You know my cousin Thomas? Are you aware I'm Rhyme's sister? Oh, wow. Right, so that makes us... That makes us two strangers walking to school. Even if you won't talk to me, do you know any other girls who would? The boys won't let me sit with them unless I kiss a girl. The girls are the exact same way. They're either obsessing over boys or dancing. At least you have friends. Do you think any of them would go to the pep rally with me? Hey, Brittany, will you go with this guy I met, PK, just so we can make friends? If you won't do that, what about us? We could go together. Sorry, buddy. I've seen that move before. Nice try. Asking Katie. I told you I'm asking her. You've been saying that all week, Edward. <laughs> well, I'm doing it. Hey, you can try, but I'm gonna ask her. You should just go with Layla. As if. Yeah. As if. I like the stickers on your board. Who? Me? <laughs> Unless it's someone else's. Nah, that one's definitely yours. Really pretty. Uh, the board, I mean. See you around. <laughs> Scratch that walk. Layla's spoken for us. Stop, he just liked my board. I think she's blushing. You, you guys are so <laughs> annoying. <laughs> but I'm not afraid of storms, for I'm learning how to sail my ship. Come home, dear, and I'll find your boot, Jack. Come home, dear. Darnell. Keep going, Claire. Come home, dear, and I'll find your boot, Jack. I suppose that's what you're rummaging after among my things. Thanks, Claire. Okay, let's stop there for today. Does everyone have a partner for the final worksheets? Harmony. I don't have a partner. Huh, guess we're an odd number. All right, let's pair you with Eggy and Claire. I don't get why Eggy wants to be partners with Claire. Why do you think? She's a know-it-all, but she does all the work. Then why does she want to be partners with him? Because he's Eggy. Why do you think? He walks on water. Everyone does everything for him. I feel like he's definitely gonna ask me to the pep rally. A few weeks ago at the Millwood Galleria, we were definitely flirting. But you can't tell Belle, she would kill me. I don't think you've noticed, but I'm not exactly sharing my secrets with Belle. Pinky swear? Shoot, gotta get my homework. Okay. Katie? Yeah? Uh, how's your Wednesday? It's Tuesday. Right, uh, so I was wondering if you're not busy, if you'd want to go to the pep rally together? I'd love to, but I can't commit just yet. There's probably someone else who's going to ask me. Someone else? I don't know yet, but I'll definitely let you know. It's a little early for spring cleaning. My math homework is here somewhere. This math homework? I could have sworn it was here. Number four is wrong. PEMDAS, remember? Parentheses, exponents, division. Multiplication first, then division, addition, subtraction. Here, let me help. Oh, no, that's okay. I, I got it. I owe you one. Me? For what? You probably don't remember. Callie Tritcher's third grade birthday party. The ice skating one. Yeah. <laughs> I wore hockey skates and she tried to kick me out, but you told her to take a chill pill. I did. See, now we're even Steven. Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. Does it ever get annoying winning everything? Why would I want to lose? When the guidance counselor calls my mom about feeling a pop quiz, she's just like, well, that's gus for you. The bar's low. I guess I've never failed the pop quiz. 
Yeah, it's tough to fail when Claire Fitcher does all your homework. It's called a group project, dweeb. Don't look now, but we got incoming, 11 o'clock. Which teacher? Thank again, Belle Oscar, coming right for you in three, two... Hey, Aggie. Uh, Belle, uh, hey, what's up? Just remember, my dog ate my homework, gotta run. Uh, what? Gus. Mind if I sit? Thanks. Uh, sure, right. You know what's so funny? So while I was eating breakfast this morning, our moms were on the phone. And not that I was eavesdropping or anything, but I heard my mom say, Belle hasn't told me who she's going with either. I think they're talking about the pep rally. Isn't that so funny? Yeah, that's hilarious. Like, come on, Mom, don't you have anything else to talk about than if me and Eggie are going together? Maybe she was talking about something else. But it got me thinking, since I'm going to be captain of the dance team and you're going to be football captain next year, people are probably going to be expecting certain things from us. Right. And you wouldn't want to disappoint them. At least I wouldn't. Would you? Right. I mean, no. I... Right. Good. Glad we're on the same page. Exponents. Mind if I sit here? Yeah, Great. of course. I'm in the middle of something, but sure. Can I help you? Look, Harm, you're one of my oldest friends, so I'm going to tell it to you straight. Okay. Belle, she's really nice and all. Except when you got on her bad side. This one girl at dance camp stepped on Belle's foot, and the next morning, Girl got boogers in her oatmeal. Do you want boogers in your oatmeal? No, I do not want boogers in my oatmeal. Great. So my suggestion is that you come by practice today and go up to Belle and tell her you're so sorry and make nice. Don't make me choose sides harm, because real talk, I'm unpredictable. I read you loud and clear. Now, can I get back to my math assignment? Remember harm, boogers, oatmeal. Where's the rest of the squad? <laughs> Some football thing. Boys only. I never got into football. Tackling seems kind of uncivilized. <laughs> well, no one invited me to play. You're definitely not missing out. Hey, speaking of invited, has anyone asked you to the pep rally yet? The boys keep saying they're going to ask girls, but knowing them, we'll all just roll together. I was thinking maybe we could roll together. Me? But you don't even know me. Yeah, that's kind of the point of a date. Oh. Um. I guess we could. OK, sure. Awesome. So I'll see you soon. performance. It's not how we dance, it's how we present. So that's why we need a team captain to keep us in step. Any nominations? I nominate Belle Bosker for team captain. Any seconds? Um, I'll second. Anybody else? Hey, Harmony! <laughs> what? You're running against me? Excuse me? You had your chance and you walked away. So I'm gonna be team captain and that's that. Right, girls? I wasn't going out for captain. I was going out for the team. Well, thanks for your interest. Auditions are now closed. Better luck next year. Good, because I don't want to be on your stupid dance team. You know, as a matter of fact, stay away from my oatmeal. What happens at dance camp stays at dance camp. And as for you, your date to the dance is Walker, so you better say yes. next week on Chicken Girls. And why are you here? Bullying can get you suspended a data way. So you here? Just got a date to the rally? No way. Being popular means being on the dance team, flirting with the cool guys, and sitting with the right people at lunch. Do you want a date or not? <laughs>